after getting support from various other custom ROMs, now Loico L2 has got official support from Moki ROM of Moki Open Source. So today let's take a look at Android 7.1 Nougat based Moki ROM for the Loico L2. So as usual, in order to flash the custom ROM, you need to have a custom recovery installed on your device. So I will leave a link to the latest TWAP recovery in the description below so if you haven't already installed it just make sure that you download and install the custom record so now you need to download two zip files the rom and the gap zip files i will leave a link for both the zip files in the description below you can download the rom file from official moki website itself and the gaps is an open gap so you can download it from open gaps website but make sure that you download ARM64 version of Android 7.1 based Pico gaps uh, because that's what is suggested. So, once you have downloaded both zip files, place them on your internal storage and power off your device. Now, hold the volume up button and the power button to reboot into recovery mode. Now, in recovery mode, select wipe and swipe to wipe. Now, go back, select install. And select the ROM file and swipe to flash Now select the gaps file and swipe to flash. Now go back and select reboot and select system. So remember that the first boot into your new ROM is gonna take a lot of time. I have been telling this for a very long time I guess you all probably know that so just sit back and relax So now we have put in the ROM, I will set up the ROM and I will be back. So I have been using the ROM for about a couple of hours and, and the ROM is stable except for the same bugs which is present in almost every single ROM, custom ROM that's available for the Leica L2 that is the IR Blaster is not working and the camera is a little buggy at times it works at times it does not so these are the two bugs except for that the rom is rock solid stable and it also has support for substratum so yeah kudos for that because uh, i have been using lineage OS and resurrection remix for a while and i definitely could use uh, some new themes and it also comes with OD update support so uh, yeah that is there yeah for the most part the ROM is stable except for the two bugs as I said earlier so that is it for this video guys if you like this video hit the like button for more videos hit the subscribe button and I will see you guys in the next one see ya